re gaming. Hello and welcome back. We're here on Willamina Forest trying to complete this challenge. And last episode, we got done putting in all these greenhouses. I got the water filled up. It was taking forever, so <laughs> I went ahead and just bought the water actually. A few things though, not all of these are actually operating. Uh, they require herbs or, or uh, liquid fertilizer, manure, stuff like that. I'm not going to worry about them just yet. I thought about going to get some liquid fertilizer, but I'm not too worried about it. Quick update though, I today is actually Christmas. Oh, no. The day after Christmas, by one hour. So 1 a.m. right now where I'm at. I actually, well, my wife, she got me a Christmas present for kind of this channel and my gaming. She got me a steering wheel with a sim board, gas pedal and stuff. Some farm bundle thing, as it's called. So it's got all these buttons, little joystick. I messed around a little bit, got the forklift set up pretty good, which makes it pretty fun and a lot easier now and easy to do it in first person with this joystick and everything. And I was working on the tree harvester. There's a little more functions in there that makes it a little more difficult to do, but I think I got it where I want it. I have those greenhouses in. I need to figure out where to put or where to sell it all. Thing is fruits and vegetables or something like that. I don't know. I guess I do sell everything. I also have that uh, maple syrup put in, so I have these flowers put in. I do not have everything to start making them, so I'm not worried about that yet. Maple syrup production, so I can sell here. I'll end up needing to put that in. And I'll probably put in a few other things, too. Kind of what I want to do this episode is make a little farmer's market, maybe? put in a bunch of these places like this. This is the sell vegetable one. I don't think I'm making a few of these actually. I don't know. I don't remember what, what they have there. Yeah, I'm making grapes. So I need somewhere to sell that. I don't think I'm going to put a vending machine in, but we'll see. Why not? If it works, it works. Who knows? Maybe it'll pay more than the other places. Let's get everything loaded up. Well, I don't even know if I'm going to load it up. I might just use the follow me mod and have everybody follow over there. Might be a little faster than trying to get something on that trailer. There we go. All set up. Might notice something a little different. I am going to try a different trailer. I know I'm going to be losing link there. This trailer is only what 13 meters long so i'm gonna cut my logs down to 12 maybe maybe just do that 13 meter i'm not sure i believe i got everybody set up the thing is that trailer's just so long it's hard to get around especially when cutting out new areas so that's the idea there so let me make sure everybody's following correctly yeah it's doing good it's amazing driving with this steering wheel and main thing is having that gas pedal because now I don't have to set a cruise. I'm just doing 22. I'm not going balls to the wall here. Speeding up real fast. And then slowing down. Used to, I'd always have to try to keep my cruise control right around that 45, 50 miles an hour. But now I can control the speed pretty good with my foot. And uh, let's see if it does 90. Uh, let me get over to our main city town area. And I'm going to look around, try to figure out where I could put this. Figure out what I want to kind of do. So, be back with y'all in just a second. Ooh, yeah. Oh, no, no, no. So, I think I decided uh, this area over here is going to kind of be the farmer's market area. I'm going to try to leave quite a bit of trees. Kind of leave like a nature look to it. Because I can't add trees there's a tree limit i think there's a mod to get rid of that but i could plant trees too and just let them grow in but i think i'm gonna try to work around the trees that are here so i don't have to plant any and do a little decoration and stuff 
I'll figure it out. I have to be doing quite a bit. That's a good thing I got that small trailer, actually, because now it's definitely going to be a tight fit if I'm leaving some of these trees. And looking back here, might be wondering where the rest of my stuff is. Well, on my way over, I got, was going kind of fast and ramped coming over this hill and ran into this tree. And I figured out whenever you back up on that follow mod. Oh, man. It's not following anymore. That tree harvester stopped. Oh, well, I'll get it over here. Whenever you back up on that follow mod, it tends to kind of mess up the whole follow me thing. And plus, I ran into a tree anyways, so... This tractor ran into that same tree. All right. Let me get a tree harvester over here, and then we'll get to work on this. We'll figure this out. And I'll see if I use my joystick and steering wheel here for that. I don't know. I know it'd be a lot easier if I had dual joysticks for sure. Just going to bring y'all back for a little bit of an update. So I think I got a plan. Obviously, I'm going to need to be able to get in here with a semi at least a few times. I'll make these deliveries myself. Then I'll set it up on automatic distribution or sell. I'm going to make kind of kind of up, come up this direction and then wrap around, do a little wrap around there. But I'm going to put my selling points back in this direction. So what I'll do is I'll pull up in here. And then I'll just back up to the cell points over here. That's kind of the idea I'm visualizing in my head right now. So let's see how it goes. Just want to bring y'all back, give you a little update and pop in a little bit of a time lapse, I guess, too. <laughs> So there we go, got everything cleared out. Got a few ideas here. One thing is I kind of want to start from the lowest area, which is right here, the exit. Work my way up maybe, I'm not sure. I might remove some more trees. We'll see what happens. But let me pop this into the time lapse and get to it.
going to wrap up this episode here. Just got done building this nice little farmer's market, overlook area, playground. I don't know, just a whole like kind of park area. I really like it. It's amazing. Uh, let me know what you think about this build. Huh? I think it's pretty nice. I mean, I said I'm not going to spend too much time decorating or anything and try to get through the challenge, but then here I am spending all this time making stuff like this. But, I mean, it's part of the game. Just want to have some fun with it. Actually enjoy it. I hope that's all I need as far as the farmer market stuff. I didn't notice anything else in my sell points. I'll figure it out as I go if I need to add something. I think there's room to add stuff. And I think it's going to work out pretty good as far as selling. At least I hope it does. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please hit that like and subscribe button. It makes a huge difference. Y'all have a great day or night, wherever you're at. Bye.